So in this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way you can make millions of coins in FC Mobile. So make sure to like and subscribe if you are excited for it. This is pretty much the easiest way you can go ahead and make these coins in about five minutes. It's not going to take that long. So make sure to follow all the steps and make sure you know everything about it. So basically what you need to do is you need to find some players. For example, you need to find a player where uh, when you go on and rank them up, they're worth a lot more coins than their normal version. For example, uh, you can go and find them with other players. If you, if you got a lot of players in your team, you can go and find them in your team. If you don't have a lot of players in your team, then you can go ahead and search them for the, for the market 80 overalls, 79 overalls, 81s, whichever one you want. For example, as we've got here, Sylvester right there, as you can see, he's worth about 60,000 uh, 60, coins. And um, if you go ahead and rank him up fully, um, he's worth 1.57 million coins right there, as you can see. And to rank them up, rank a card fully guaranteed, no probability or nothing like that. If you want to guarantee uh, that uh, you're going to rank your player up five times, you will have to have 19 player, 19 of the same players, of course. So if you go ahead and get 19 of these players for about 60,000 coins, 19, sorry, 19 of these players, 60,000 uh, uh, 60, coins, that is. So you're going to be spending less than 1.2 million coins for that. And when you go on and rank him up fully, you are going to be able to sell him for 1.57 million coins. I'm going to show you a very, very good example right now. I'm going to show you how I'm going to make coins. But this is basically how it is. You can sell him for 1.57 mil and you can go ahead and buy him for less than 1.2 mil. That's pretty much how it goes. For example, I've got this 79 overall Jose Sa right there. As you can see, I went ahead and bought 18 other versions of him uh, because if, if you go there, he's worth about 80,000 coins. If you go there, I went ahead and bought them for about 74,000 coins. So if we go, uh, if we take a look at it, 74,000 times 19, I'm not sure exactly. Let's go ahead and get into the calculator actually. So it was 74,100, no, 74,100. Uh, 74, times 19 let's see how many how much coins that is that is just about 1.4 million coins as, as you can see i already had one of them but i'm gonna count that one as well because you exactly need 19 players for that so i'm gonna be able to get 19 of these cards for um obviously uh for obviously 1.4 million coins and if you go ahead and take a look at it i will be able to sell him for 1.8 mil so that's gonna be quite a decent amount of profit right so i actually needed 19 players so i actually spent 1.416 mil right it's still 1.4 it's a little bit more um i could have spent 74,000 for the last one but i want to get it very very quickly so i spent 83,000 coins it's still 1.4 million coins it's still 1.4 million coins just about that and now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and rank him up max i'm gonna max him, rank him up and you'll see what happens after that let's go and take Jose Sal. let's go on and put him in our team actually if we can please um, now we need to go and search for him again. There we go, Jose Sa, and I'm gonna rank him up. You will see how many players it takes to go and rank him up as well. From level uh, level one to level two, it takes one um, player, as you can see right there. From level two to level three, it takes one player as well, I'm pretty sure. Let's continue, it takes one player as well. Here we are, it's gonna be ranked up to rank two. From level two to level three though, it, it's a little bit interesting because um, if you put one player, you're going to have 50% possibility. But if you want it to be 100% probability, you will have to put two players in. That's what I'm going to do. And that's how you need 19 players. If you get lucky, you can maybe do it with like less players, like 15, 14. But I'm just going to use um, all the players just so you won't you won't be mad at that and just so you won't say it's about luck and that. So from level four to level so, or to level three to level five, uh, level three to level four sorry you need five players to be to have 100 percent probability of getting your player from um rank three to rank four and um you will need 10 players to get your player from rank four to rank four to rank five with 100 percent probability you can maybe do it with like six players seven players eight players nine players nine players but i'm gonna use all 19 players i'm gonna use all 10 players there and now he became an 84 overall card right there as i said you don't need to do it with only Jose Sa. you can go on and find any player in your market and uh, in your club and make sure you go ahead and times that to 19 
and if that player ranked uh if the if that player um is worth more at ranked five than what you get uh, on your calculator um then you will be making some good amount of profit now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go into my players of course and i'm actually gonna sell that uh, 84 overall Jose card as you can see somebody already wants him for 1.88 million coins there we go i'm gonna go ahead and confirm and you will see that not only i'm gonna make Quite a few coins but he's gonna sell straight away 84 overall Jose Sardan here we go he's gonna sell at any second now and there we go then I'm gonna claim coins and I've claimed about 1.7 million coins that's about 300k profit a minimum amount of 280,000 coins right minimum amount of 218,000 coins and I'm gonna go ahead and claim of course Bam, you might think that's not, not really that much, 280,000, 300,000, but you can do that over and over again. I can go ahead and buy a whole lot more Jose Sa cards now, or I can go ahead and buy that card I was talking about, um, 79 overall, was it? 79 overall, Sylvester. I can go ahead and buy, for example, 19 of these Sylvester's cards and make sure I sell him uh, for 1.5 million coins, once again, 1.6 mil. I can probably sell him for 1.57 million coins. Um, and I'll be making good amount of profit with that one as well. So it's that easy to make profit in this game. It's that easy to make coins. Um, you just need to you just need to find players um, who are worth a lot more um, at rank five. For example, some of them are obviously not worth. With most of them, you're gonna lose some coins. But there are some cards where you can go on and make a lot of coins. Let's go and check Dan Burn for example. He's worth fifty thousand coins and at rank uh, five. He, you can sell him for 1 million coins as you can see so you're not making any profit from that you're not making any profit from Dan Burn. you're not making any profit really a little bit but not really much profit with Genduzi as well make sure to find players where you're going to be making a lot of coins use calculator make sure you go ahead and times that, uh, that price uh, to 19 and um, if that price is a lot lower than the rank 5 player um, that's the same player at rank five, then you're gonna be making quite a few amount of coins, just like I, I did with uh, 79 overall um, Jose Sadar, and just like I'm gonna do with this Sylvester card. I'm gonna go and buy 19 of them for 60,000 coins. That's gonna be less than 1.2 mil, of course. And then I'm gonna be able to sell him for 1.5, seven, seven million coins. I'm gonna be making a lot more coins again. I'm gonna do it more and more with Jose Sa with every single other cards you can go and make a lot of profit other than that uh, if you go like a lot of bronze players in your teams and you don't really uh, want to use them you can go and sell those cards as well for example this bronze card is worth tw 24 million coins 23 million coins i can go ahead and sell him make easy coins if you want to go on and do that if you don't want to use those players as trainings uh, at this point you can go on and do that very very easily as well this card is 13,000 coins. Some of these bronze cards are worth a lot more as well, like 20,000 coins for that random 69 overall card right there. Bam, that one that I showed you with Jose size, the easiest way you can make coins. Anyways, that's gonna be the end of the video for today. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it and peace.